your girl Shaquana coming to you loud, live, and in color. Hey, my people. Hey, my people. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? First of all, I want to say I am finally, finally monetized. <laughs> I am finally, 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 finally monetized. I'm going to put the email right up in here, y'all. Finally monetized. <laughs> anyway, but I'm just waiting on it to let me put the ads on because for some reason the ads are not showing on the videos. But I'm just going to have to just be patient. But anyway, welcome back to my channel. I appreciate y'all for coming back, liking, commenting, giving me thumbs up, thumbs down. I appreciate everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you to my new subscribers. I appreciate you for coming to my channel. Subscribing. I appreciate it. It was something that you liked. So I appreciate you. Today is another episode of Woman to Woman. And this topic is going to cause some controversy. But... Hey, it wouldn't be me if it did not cause controversy. Okay, y'all. Ladies, a lot of us feel like we can put our hands on a man because we know he not supposed to hit us back. Ladies, let me tell you something. Keep your hands to yourself you got me and i him from the school of knock a woman out okay they're not gonna care that you are a woman okay just because you are a woman you still as a woman have no business putting your hands on a man okay we're not talking about men who are abusive okay Cause you, cause you got some abusive women out here. If you are having a, a disagreement with a man, and you do not like what that man is saying, you have no business hitting that man. You have no business throwing nothing at that man. You have no business causing that man any type of bodily harm. You have no business doing this. Okay, just like a man has no business causing you bodily harm, you have no business doing the same thing. So keep your hands to yourself, ladies. My mama taught me and both my brothers to never hit nobody. She taught both of us to never put our hands on anybody unless they put their hands on you. She taught both of us this. She also taught us that if somebody hit you, you hit their behinds back. Our my my mama taught me and my brother Jonathan, cause she adopted me and my brother Jonathan. Now my brother Arnez, my baby, my baby brother, he was taught by his grandmother, who is me and Jonathan's mother. I grab, I you know we all got the same grandmama, but because I'm adopted and my and my brother Jonathan is adopted, my grand we don't call our grandmother grandmother, we call her mama. So our mother, my baby brother's grandmother, told us all never put your hands on anybody unless you want them to put their hands on you. Okay? So keep your hands to yourselves we feel like as women we can do what we want to do as women to men and don't let that happen to us no should no man have to walk away when you put your hands on them if you feel big bad and bold enough to put your hands on a man you should be able to take the lick that he gives you you should be able to take that shake 
that he bestows upon you. Because you have no business putting your hands on a man. You have no business doing that. Keep your hands to yourselves, ladies. Because we as women, we feel like, mm, we, we have the right to do whatever we want to do to a man. Say whatever we want to say to a man. And I hate double standards. I hate that double standard. As women, we need to know how to control our anger. Just like men need to know how to control their anger. We need to do the same because we got anger issues just like men got anger issues. And we as women do not have the right to put our hands on men because we are angry because we cannot get our way. If you feel the need to put your hands on a man, go walk. Go get, go talk to somebody. Because you got men out here that are not going to walk away. You're going to have men out here that's going to knock you out. And I'm tired of hearing men are stronger than women. You got some women out here that are stronger than a bunch of men. Let's 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 just put that out there. You got some men, some women out here that are stronger than a lot of these men out here. Okay. And if and 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 and, and, and even if the women are not stronger than the man, a woman can take an object and hit that man. And not come out with that object. So people need to stop saying that men are stronger than women. Women can pick up an object and it makes herself, it, it makes her stronger at that moment. And she needs to not do that. Do not, I, I repeat, do not put your hands on a man as a woman if you do not want to be hit. Now, ladies, if you help, now, ladies, if you are victims of domestic violence, you know I am not talking about you. You know I am not condoning violence against women. I'm not condoning violence at, at all. But you got women out here that cannot have a civil conversation, discussion with men without putting their hands on a man. You got women out here like that. I know, I knew, I ain't gonna say I know, I knew women like that. I knew women like that. That put their hands on men because they already know the man is not supposed to hit the woman. Okay, I'm not condoning violence, but I'm just saying everybody need to keep their hands to their cells if they do not want to be hit. Okay, teach your young boys and your young girls to keep their hands to themselves and everybody will be all right. And if you got anger issues, go seek some help. That's what needs to be done. It starts at a young age. Okay, because we're teaching my nieces and my we teaching my niece and my nephew to keep their hands to themselves because they like to hit each other. And that's not cool. That's not right. They got to love each other. Okay? Y'all comment down below. Y'all tell me what you think. I appreciate y'all participation on my videos. Be on the lookout for my next one. And this is the part of the, of the show, the segment where I say my peak and my pit my peak of being a woman is i have never in my life hit a man because i was taught better i was taught the consequences of being the aggressor okay the pit of being a woman is i am also a victim of domestic abuse Yes, I am a victim of domestic abuse. I'm 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 a I'm a I'm a domestic abuse survivor. That's me, y'all. I am a victim of it. I 
I, I was abused emotionally and psychologically and physically once he pinched me okay but if you made it to the end of my video y'all give me those big thumbs up make sure you like comment subscribe to my channel hit the bell twice to be notified if you're an old subscriber make sure your notification on share my videos like i always say god only gives you one life y'all please live it bye y'all